I am so nervous to vlog and I guess this is gonna be like my first vlog. So I don't know who's gonna watch it, but hey, we're here, we're invested. I have the footage, why not? Universal definitely lived up to its hype. If you're questioning about going and like just asking yourself, is it worth it to buy the ticket? It's definitely worth it, y'all. Like, it's definitely worth it. If you, Even if you don't ride the rides, like, just the vibes there are amazing. Everybody's so happy. It's nice. It's actually a good size amusement park. We stayed in Tampa, so we're at Clearwater today. We went to Universal, so we were in Orlando one full day. Uh, we went to Bradenton to watch a Pirates baseball game. We it's so cool because you get to see the players more up close and just interact with them more. I definitely recommend going to see some games. And then we went to the Yankees game in Tampa to watch the, uh, the Yankees play. Yeah, so I just was like, I have this gimbal and I use it to record like my videos of when I'm on vacation with my family. But like for my purposes, not for anything else. And then people are always asking me like, do you have a YouTube channel? And I'm like, always like, no, I don't. I mean, I do, but I record like my videos on it. It's not for like personal vlogging. And then I was like, why? And then somebody was like, why don't you do it? And I was like, you're right, why don't I do it? So, you know what, we're here. I'm just gonna tell you how much I paid for things, what I did. I feel like it was really exciting. They have amazing outlets. I love to shop. Um, so you'll see a lot of stuff. Sorry, I was looking up at the helicopter because there's like a helicopter in the air. The water's freezing. But yeah, so let me just, let me tell you what I did. So I guess it's gonna be the start of the video and then I'll just insert clips and stuff because like I recorded an entire universal walkthrough of everything like after I did everything with my family and stuff like that. I rode all my rides I wanted to ride. I was able to do like a walkthrough showing everything. She's beauty, she's grace, she's Miss United States. Just kidding, y'all. Okay, so this is like the Spider-Man section. That was the Harry Potter section. This is like the Spider-Man Transformers section. We paid $2.09 for tickets and that got us into two parks. Volcano Bay was closed because it was like really cold that day. I'm like, the one day we choose to come to Universal, the water park is closed. We had driven by the day before and it was not closed, but whatever. So we paid 209 That got us into both parks. As you can see, everybody's there. They did open like some of the water rides later on and you'll see people drying. It was just too cold to me. Like I wasn't going to do it, but hey, to each his own. Um, so yeah, so we had a really good time and I hope you guys like the video and I'll post walkthrough video of everything I did. Please enjoy. I saw my friend here and she's staying like on the universal ground situation. And she said that last time she came to universal, it was a lot more packed than this. So don't say, I didn't tell you. So we've actually been able to ride rides. The longest wait we waited in was an hour. Um, it was an hour, but the time said it was gonna be two hours, so it worked out. Now, like all this is throwing water out, y'all. It's it's 65 degrees outside. 65 degrees cold. Okay, so let's. Uh, I think this is the exit. We're at Clearwater Beach. I wish there would have been more videos on Clearwater. So. We rented this cabana, I'll show you in a second. And it comes with two chairs and an umbrella cabana. And if you come before three o'clock, it's $45, okay? $45 and it comes with two beach chairs or two beach loungers. All right, well, if you come after three o'clock, three o'clock or after, it's only $25 because it closes at five. This beach closes at five. So, uh, and then we parked at this like Holiday Inn, I'll have to go see what it is, a Holiday Inn resort called like Sand Resort. Um, that was $30 for parking. Um, so it's really not a bad deal. Like the people who had this cabana were like, hey, do you want it? And I was like, uh, yes, yes. And it's right off the water, so why not? Uh, totally took it. Um, yeah, and then they have like boat tours that take you to like go see the dolphins and stuff, which is like really, really, really cool. But I'll just go through everything that I bought. I'll show y'all a walkthrough of the beach. There are so many people here, it's wild. Um, but why not spend spring break in Florida? Like, oh, some of the rides at Universal got up to 225 minutes. I was like, child, I cannot. 
but yeah so um i guess this is gonna be my vlogging journey next time you'll see me i'll probably be at the airport because i don't know what else to vlog in between that but i do have footage of everything that i've done and um i'll put like pricing up there oh yeah at the sand resort here at clearwater you can um it's open to the public so the resort's not open to the public but like the resort bar that's back here is open to the public this is opal sand resort and this is the sandbar restaurant that connects to the opal sand resort we did not stay at the resort because it was extremely expensive. I want to say for a few days during spring break, it was going to cost us like $3,000 and that just was not in my budget. So we stayed in Tampa and we drove down to Clearwater, which was just like a 45 minute drive. And that was with traffic. And we just spent the day out there. And I totally recommend parking here. Like there's a public parking lot right next to it so you do want to get there early to find you a spot but it's like very inexpensive and then if that's full you can park at one of the resort parking lots they do charge you like $30 a day but you get to spend your entire day at the beach and then if you want to go eat walk up to this little restaurant and eat and you can still get a view of the water we saw dolphins in the water it was a great time I recommend so you can like go up there and get your drinks they have like alcohol soft drinks water um, if you want some like kid drinks, you know, Shirley Temples and stuff, they got all that here. But um, I guess this is gonna be my first official vlog, my first like one and a half official vlog. I'm excited. I'm scared though. I'm really scared because people say I have an, like an outgoing personality and I don't think I do. I feel like I'm very shy. Um, I like talking to people. So I guess I'll just talk to the camera like I talk to people. Maybe, maybe. All right, well, let me go show y'all this like amazing view. Clearwater had beautiful water that day. You can see all the resorts lined up. So you don't have to stay exactly where I stayed by the Opal Sands or by the Sandbar. It, I mean, they have so many resorts going down, but you can just see the water was so pretty. The dolphins came out and they swam really close to us. It was just a really nice day. So many seagulls, be careful. They attack. Well, yeah, I hope y'all uh, stay tuned and continue to watch. And I go on a few vacations a year. Like I always try to do a ski trip or in order, like a spring break trip, a summer trip, uh, something for my birthday to November, usually Vegas, and then uh, a ski trip in the winter time. So I try to hit all the seasons up and then like try to just do other things. But yeah, stay tuned. I guess I'm gonna have videos. I don't know. What, what am I gonna record? I'm a big couponer. I have no life. I like to coupon on the side. There, there's really not much about me. I'm very, I'm very plain Jane. But I'm good. Yo, next time you'll see me, you'll see me at the airport. Orlando Airport, spring break. Everyone's coming home from Disney. All the kids are happy. All the parents are grumpy. It was a time. <laughs>